It's at least another 8 to 12 weeks before Ohio State finds out if the self-imposed sanctions were enough to satisfy the NCAA's infraction committee. This morning, as expected, former Ohio State head football coach Jim Tressel was in Indianapolis to answer more than four hours worth of questioning by the NCAA's infraction committee on the cash for memorabilia scandal involving a Columbus tattoo parlor that resulted in player suspensions. Athletic Director Gene Smith and school president Gordon Gee both appeared before the committee as well. After the meeting, Smith reading from a prepared statement as to what happens next. Following this hearing, we will be working with the NCA staff to move forward to wrap up uh, remaining issues uh, that we have been conducting an inquiry on. We now look forward to working together so that we can conclude this follow-up and work as quickly as possible. Now, Jim Tressel did not answer any questions, but he did release a statement where he again apologized to, as he put it, Buckeye Nation, as well as the players, staff, and fans for the scandal that led to his resignation.